I'm Walt Wager and today I'm going to talk about using the Merlin in a wood turning environment. One advantage of the Merlin is the speed at which you can do things. You can do the carving and the sanding and the sculpturing much faster using these than you can in other ways. In terms of my creativity, there are many things that I would never have thought of doing before without using the Merlin. I'm going to use the Signature Series all-surface three-edge disc with tungsten carbide on both sides and on the edge. There are four in this set, from extremely coarse to fine grit. I'm going to start off with how I use the Merlin to texture something like this simple box. I'm going to use one of the new green carbide discs to make the lines that become the texture in the box. I'm going to use this yellow abrasive brush on the Merlin tube to clean up and smooth the edges. You can paint that or stain it or just leave it natural and the texture gives it some real character. Next I'm going to show you how I make these open holoforms. I use a green disc to cut grooves in the piece that I'm going to hollow. So now I have all the binds cut, and as I hollow it, shavings will start to come out through the bind. So I have it hollowed pretty evenly, and now I can come back in with a green disc and clean up the binds. The rest is a matter of sanding. I can use this quick change sanding disc to smooth over the edges of the binds. These sanding discs are available in 5 grits from 24 to 240 grit using the HTC backing pad on the grinder. Next I'm going to use the Merlin to shape the inside of this platter when I get it turned. The contoured carbide discs make quick work of carving and blending in the surface of this platter. And then the sanding system will help me finish it off. So there are many ways to use this Merlin too, and its many attachments on your wood turning. You can use it for carving, embellishments, sanding, and finishing. Merlin 2 will greatly expand your horizons in creativity and opportunities.